<laughs> Hello. Hello, long time no drawing. <laughs> ah. Hi, Palo. Hello, hi, Pine Sando. Hi, Plangus. Hello, past or future Tabby. <laughs> hi, Tuna. Ha 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 ha. Yes, yes, yes. Before, actually, wait, don't look yet. Don't look yet. <laughs> actually, you can look over here. Okay, you can look over here. Okay. <laughs> um, I hope you had a good week, right? Today's Friday. It's Friday. Um, so <laughs> it's been so long since I've done anything other than Terraria stream. Yeah, it has been a while. Um, so I move things around a little because when I'm doing a drawing stream, I want the canvas to be as big as possible on stream. Um, so I just have chat floating up there. <laughs> Wait, did I say so so week? Oh, or you had a so so week. Okay. I mean, at least it's not bad. Hopefully, hopefully you'll have a good weekend now. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So. Let's do some stream housekeeping, shall we? So last, my last stream, which was that emergency Terraria stream, you guys in chat were saying how there was no game audio, but I, I saw that there was audio on OVS, so I just assumed it was super quiet or something, but there was just no game audio. So I need to check now. Do you hear background music? Do you hear background music and like, is it okay? <laughs> like during the Terraria stream, I was playing a set of drums. <laughs> All goof. <laughs> Thanks hype. Thanks Plangus. <laughs> Thanks Nintendo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, good. That's good. Oh my gosh. Hi Ahmed. I think this is the first non Terraria stream you're tuning into. I'm doing a drawing stream today, <laughs> and I think tomorrow I'll do a Terraria stream. Mm -hmm. But um, yes, where was I? Okay, so now we got the audio out of the way. Oh yeah, so during during that emergency Terraria stream, I was playing a drum kit, and I was trying to say like how it wasn't worth the money. But you guys, you guys couldn't even hear me play the drums in that Terraria stream. But I'll show you guys next Terraria stream because I, I don't have Terraria open. So I'll show you guys next time. Okay, so for this stream, as you can see by the title, I want to draw a spring outfit because spring is here. Well, at least it's supposed to be here, right? Like. Am I correct that only the northern hemisphere is has spring right now? Is that true? <laughs> um, yeah. Can somebody confirm that? And the southern hemisphere is not spring? I hope it's true. Anywho, spring is here in the northern hemisphere. Okay. So is this spring where you guys are? Like, is it feeling warmer a little or something? I have no idea when the season season. But how does it feel for you guys? Oh, in the southern, it's autumn, I see. Okay, I mean, I mean, I knew that. Actually, yo, I'm gonna tell you guys the reason why I know that the northern and southern hemispheres have different, like, seasons is because of Animal Crossing. Because when you choose an island in Animal Crossing New Horizons, it shows like a different weather if you're in the Northern Hemisphere versus the Southern Hemisphere. So, so at that point, I was like, oh my gosh, there's, they, the world experiences different seasons. Northern and Southern Hemisphere. <laughs> Weather's really fluctuating. I agree. It's so... Like we're on the different we're on different sides of the planet and it's also the same here. Like it was really cold and raining and then it was so hot. 
like so hot that you can't even wear like you have to wear a t-shirt or something and then it became so cold again and then it's get it's starting to get warmer so i was like okay time to bust out the new ideas the new clothing okay so you see right now i'm like i'm like all geared up in my freaking vest sweater socks hat and it's it's too hot for that now so so we're gonna think about spring today okay i'm gonna need i have some references in front of me but um i'm gonna need your opinions too <laughs> I never found any islands in Southern Hemisphere. I think... No, no, you don't find an island. I think it was like I was watching a video like how to choose the best starting island or something. And they were talking about if you're in the Northern Hemisphere, blah, blah, blah. If you're in the Southern Hemisphere, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and also, holi <gasps> holidays are not the same because Christmas for Northern Hemisphere is like winter and snow and stuff but christmas in the southern hemisphere is summer isn't that crazy guys is anyone from the southern hemisphere here actually i, I probably sound a little bit silly <laughs> animal crossing teaching people all over the world yeah i just woke up i can't process english question <laughs> well you can at least type in english which is which is pretty good Pretty good. I hope you're having a good morning. Eat some breakfast, I guess. <laughs> oh no, not the math stream. <laughs> you're sweaty in there? Yeah, a little bit. I had to turn off like, like the heater because for some reason it was still on. Can we add a spring? Like a literal spring? <laughs> it's a little bit too literal. Hmm. <clears throat> haven't had a proper snowy christmas in so long you're kind of right i don't remember if if there was snow in my area in the last christmas it's been a long time since i remember the last time i remember there was a really snowy christmas was like the one time i built like a really nice snowman Oop. stick it was like really nice snowman. <laughs> Oops. What did I do? Okay. Yeah, I hope this year we can have some a snow what's it called? A white Christmas? Yeah. My mom had me set her switch to July in the winter so she could cope with seasonal affective disorder. What does that mean? Yeah, damn you global warming. I want a white Christmas. I want there to be snow on Christmas. Oh my gosh, but People from Southern Hemisphere don't ever, ever get snow on Christmas. Oh my goodness, this is, this is too crazy to think about. I'm gonna move on. Are you gonna add a hat for your character? That's a good question. Um, like I was, okay, so now I'll finally, actually, I, I was gonna say I'll finally talk about what I did before stream, but um, the short, the quick answer for now is I can add a hat. I'll probably add some type of hair accessory. You see these different ones. But we'll talk and think about which one I should I should do. Okay, so here in this corner, this was I actually doodled this like I think a month ago or something or at least yeah, I think a month ago. And this was when um I forgot what I tweeted, but Migu responded something about to like like we need a bald tenchi or something i forgot what was the context but then i was thinking like wait but if i'm bald and my hair is supposed to represent the weather doesn't that mean there's no weather so i doodled this quick little informational uh guide <laughs> on if you look at my hair and this is what it looks like um this is probably the weather in the area yeah so you don't ever want to see a bald tenchi because if there's a bald tenchi then you're probably not 
not alive. There's probably no air. Um, yeah. So unless you're like some kind of, um, wait, what doesn't need air to survive? Do cockroaches need air? Oh my god, that'd be so bad. <laughs> the roof is moving. That's not, that's not supposed to happen. It's not supposed to happen. Wait, your hair represents the weather? That's a good question. <laughs> this is a developing, developing lore. I don't know if I want it to represent the weather like exactly in that moment or something because then like I don't know how that's gonna work it's gonna keep changing or something <laughs> so so I have to think about it yeast yeast is not an animal though is it wait is yeast alive like the thing you put into bread do you need air um that's a good question. Oh my gosh. I need to lore craft, guys. I need to spend some time to lore craft. Do I need air? Do weather spirits need air? I guess I do because I rely on the weather. Because if there's no air and there's no weather, then there's no weather spirit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just a little confused right now. We're talking about talking about my character here the story of of her yes <laughs> yeah all animals need air yeast is bacteria so we're putting bacteria in our bread well i mean it's delicious so it's it's okay all right so i've got this out of the way so now i can finally talk about what little doodles i did before stream <laughs> so for a for a spring outfit i kind of want something that's a little bit more feminine like like you know like cutesy and you know i don't know <laughs> so but i was thinking right so the first hairstyle oh by the way i'm thinking of changing hairstyle and clothes so yeah so the first hairstyle i thought of was actually this like updo let me oops wait it looks like she's looking at her <laughs> okay so one up and i right up do so i think this is when half of your hair a little bit hard to see but it's like when half of the hair is tied up right this is supposed to be a scrunchie or something so half of the hair is tied up and then the other half is just down so i think this is a very like you know very very pretty very spring it feels like spring is made for cute outfits i know right <clears throat> okay so I can live out my cute outfit dreams over here. So this is one. Um, it's it's kind of simple, but it's nice, I think. So the rest of these, I didn't really think about too much. I was just kind of doodling them blindly while passively looking at some photos. <laughs> so actually, these aren't really... I don't know. These are sort of just like doodle dumps. But they're okay options. So this one is a bit of a shorter hair. And it's like curlier. Is this even... Like it's it's swooping up, you see here? Which I think is kind of cute. And also shorter hair is is pretty nice. Especially in, the, in spring and summer. But I don't know yet. The train service. <laughs> oh my god, that penguin! The crying penguin emoji is so sad. It's so good. Okay, well, I hope you make it out of the train. Okay, <laughs> we'll, we'll see you. We'll see you on the other side. Okay, have a good train journey. And the rest of these, I don't know. This one... This one is also more curly. 
and it's also poofy. Yeah, this one is poofy. I guess what's separating three from two is the poofiness of this one. Poofy, poofy. Meanwhile, this one's going inside. Hmm. I kind of like the poofy feeling, though. I don't know. This is so hard. <laughs> Watching in 144p. How's the audio though? <laughs> Is the audio like like choppy, chopped up? My goodness. Oh my gosh, hair is one thing, and hair accessories are another thing. I can go with the hairband. I can go with the hat. I kind of really like the look of these ribbons that's under the chin. Those those seem cute to me audio cuts off of it oh my god you're you're a trooper okay well yeah <laughs> if i suddenly stop talking on you it's over this one this one isn't really a spring hairstyle but i was starting to think of what if it was super cloudy and then my hair would get super super poofy like all of this stuff would be the cloud looking stuff right but this is like something else this one is not gonna be for the spring is your hair texture changing because right now it's straight and that really restricts your hairstyle option hair texture um oh you mean like yeah i'm i'm not gonna keep it straight <laughs> Like, I mean, it depends on the hairstyle, right? It can be curly. It can be poofy. It can still be straight. I'll see. Yeah, so hairstyles aside. Wow, this one is even shorter hair. I don't know. Do you guys think long hair or short hair? Or medium hair? I've also asked myself, like... Am I a long hair gal, or do I prefer short hair? I don't know. I think I prefer short hair just because it's... It's kind of... It's less hair to draw. <laughs> and it looks pretty cute. But... But long hair is pretty good too. Like, long hair looks really cool. Especially if it's in like a ponytail or something. Storms? St yeah, storms would be kind of crazy. I don't know what would happen if there was a storm. Like, I don't want electricity to zap out of my hair, you know? Bald, bald, Plangus, we went over this. If I'm bald, there is no weather. <laughs> this is a bad sign. You don't want bald. <laughs> oh yeah, the efficiency. Yeah, if I could just chop off all of this hair, then there's a lot less to draw. But also, like, you see how cute this is? Like, just a short hair? I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. It's- I think it's cute. Let me see. I had some other notes. Maybe I didn't have other notes. <laughs> Goodness. Usually, like I say this every time, I think. Usually I have things that I want to say on stream written down somewhere. But for this stream, um, I didn't have time to even write them down, so I'm just- I'm just on my own, guys. <laughs> I think around shoulder length, really? So, like, one of two or three. <gasps> oh, there's something I remembered. Okay, so you guys remember I brought up, um, the Haruhi, the dance from Haruhi, right? Where had it, had it. You cut. I think I'm like 95% done with this one. With learning it. And also the exciting thing is that I I have I have the cosplay for it now for Haruhi. So I'm excited to wear it and then and then and then do the dance in my in my event. So I hope that goes well. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
only I was four minutes behind. How can you tell? I long gave up on my notes, right? Like, no, I, I mean, maybe if I go without notes, I'll start getting better at just, at just, what's the word? Just chatting, yapping it up on the spot. <laughs> Kai Yuki. Who is that? Why does it sound familiar? Do, 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 do. Huh? Why does it say... Oh, the Vocaloid? Is this the one that was singing the Windy song? Yeah, yeah, I think it is. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's so cool. Will there be video recording? Yes, question mark. I mean, I want to record myself doing it. I do want to share it. I'll think about it. Like, as for myself, I'm not entirely opposed to, like, showing the dance. But the logistics of showing it, I don't know. I'll have to think about it. <laughs> or or I can just video it and then save it for the far, far future. It's set on the scroll bar. Oh, it gives you a timestamp or something? Okay, anyways, let's actually design spring outfits. Okay, I do want to dress of some kind, I think. I'm looking at my references. Honestly, <laughs> if I was lazy, I would just go with this, but let's let's just doodle more stuff. Actually, can I do this? <laughs> We love copy paste. Okay. So if I do shoulder length here. Hmm. Sure, sure, no pressure. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No worries. I feel like that looks a little poly like. Yeah, I mean, like, this doodle is just. <laughs> yeah, she just. She looks young. <laughs> a little. Old. I think it's maybe just her height or her proportions. I mean, I'm okay with it just for the purpose of drawing the outfit, maybe. Okay, I'm drawing at an angle again, so it's a little bit wonky for me. Wait, is the hair water or air? Well, Plangus, as you may know, what makes up clouds is in fact water particles. So technically, you could say it's water. But if you wanted to be more accurate, it's, it's clouds. Oh. Actually, I guess there's layers to this question, or to this answer. So this part is a cloud, right? But the blue parts that you see is not cloud. That's just air. That's the atmosphere. <laughs> is the hat wet? No, no, no. Oh my gosh, wait, this is a good question, actually. If, <laughs> if something touches the... Wait. Actually, do people- would people know this? If- if you touch a cloud, would it feel wet? Or would it just feel like air? If you touch a cloud. That's basically the same... Similar thing as... Touching- Touching smoke? So wouldn't it feel like air if you touch a cloud? Yggdrasil from GBF. Oh, actually, I can see it. Hi, Ahmed. Welcome back. <laughs> We're thinking about how it feels to touch a cloud. Would it feel like water or would it feel like air? Fog, maybe? Oh, that's true. 
Wait, but even touching fog is a little bit strange because when you are walking through fog, it kind of feels like wet on your skin. But like, it's not like you're walking through water, right? Making me think of Atla. I still have to watch Atla. <laughs> I don't know when I'll ever get around to it. Okay, I'm gonna change the outfit as well. Maybe not long sleeve since it's warmer. Okay. But sometimes, I feel like sometimes spring can get cold, so maybe having like a light sweater is good. Okay. Uh, air. If you touch a cloud, it's like sticking your hand over a humidifier. I don't have a humidifier, so I don't know what that feels like. <laughs> Is it? I th I've heard that humidifiers are like a pretty nice thing to have in your home. Do you guys have humidifiers? Well, I mean, Ascendo seems like he has one. Because the planes touch it and do not get wet. Oh! Wait, but how do we know that? Do planes... Like, is there no water droplets on the planes? In the sky? <gasps> Mystery. When it lands. Yeah, that's true. Huh. That's true. Okay, so so it's leaning towards the, the air and not wet. Cloud, touching cloud is not wet. Opinion. <laughs> I feel like you could stretch legs and torso a bit. Um, yeah, I mean, I could. Wait, let me see what it would look like. Oh, if I stretch the torso, I have to make the sleeves also. It's empty. Oh. Oh, it's on a different layer. Okay, yeah. I think yeah, that already feels more... Don't like it feels a little long, like too long, but maybe that's okay. I fill it in. Okay. Yeah, I think that's better. Maybe it's the legs. Yeah. I have a dehumidifier. Wait. Humidifier is the opposite of dehumidifier, right? So would huh? does it does it feel different putting your hand over a dehumidifier versus a humidifier? My brain is braining now. So true. <laughs> it would feel like the floofy ends of your hat. Oh. Yeah, that's a that's another thing. Um if if this part of my hair, oops. If this part of my hair is grabbable, like would I be able to grab it? I don't know. It's a mystery. Okay. I can at least grab the blue parts of my hair. Okay. I used to use one because of my because my nose was too dry and it would bleed like crazy. If I inhale too hard. Oh, a humidifier? Oh yeah, that'd be that would be not good. So that's good. But you don't have one anymore? Hopefully that means your nose has stopped bleeding. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. What about a long skirt? I could go with a long skirt. Maybe, maybe. Oh crud.
Okay. Three minute buffer, no. Let me drink some water. Hmm. What are the fruits that are in season during spring? Lately, I have been more interested in like... Um, what's the word? Seasonal items? Like, I was watching the... NHK... There's like these three nuns. And then they have a video series where... Um, there's like, there's like 10 minute videos for each month. And it shows like little bits of what they cook or what they do during that month. So lately I've been interested. Huh, what is in season these days? No idea about seasonal fruit. <laughs> I guess seasonal anything. What are some spring-like activities? Other than flower viewing. That seems like the, the obvious one. Cherries? <gasps> that makes sense. That's... Yeah, it feels like cherries would be in season during spring, but... But my family hasn't eaten bleh, eaten any cherries yet. I think we've been eating like grapes. Oh wait, I was gonna draw a long skirt. <laughs> Japan off out, bruh. No, but seriously, these videos are so nice because they're just like living like amongst nature. And then you get to see like these foods that you don't really see cooked elsewhere sleep sleep is a spring activity <laughs> i feel like sleep like if you had to assign a season to it it would be a winter activity right like hibernation i just love everything fruity <laughs> fruity yes Whew. Ilk. Mm. I don't know how to feel about this one. Wow, I look long. What the heck? <laughs> Tennis? Oh, that's good. Tennis, a spring activity. I I don't remember the last time I played tennis. Tuna, since you brought up tennis, are you a, do you play tennis, huh? I feel like tennis is not something people usually bring up. Sleep is a nice activity. Yes, yes. Oh, do you guys do you guys know what pickleball is? Like, I don't play tennis, but I used to be really interested in pickleball. I think gardening for spring? Yeah, that's true. I guess gardening itself is an activity. That's nice. Gardening. Uh, Mama T is really into gardening, but... Ever since we moved, we didn't have space for like, you know, like to make a garden. So I hope soon, soon, once we, once we have some space, Mama Chi is going to have like her own Plants vs. Zombies garden and it's going to be so good. <laughs> She's going to have the sunflowers, the peonies, the hydrangeas, cosmos, the roses, the tomatoes. What else? <laughs> I don't know. The peas. I don't realize spring came until I miss it. What? But if you're in the northern hemisphere, it's still spring, right? So, so you didn't miss it yet. It's just starting. Sleep is a summer activity because no school, I guess. I guess it is like that for some people. What can I say? I'm just a fruity guy. I, I was wondering if you knew the other definition of fruity. <laughs> so you do. Gotta go. See ya. Yeah, I hope you have a good rest of your train ride. Barley, hi, hi, hi. <gasps> Cat hangout. Mmm, understandable. 
very understandable. Okay, this one feels really long. Okay, if I had a body under here, I wait. Okay, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, right now we're talking about what are some spring activities. So people said gardening, fruits, Tuna brought up tennis. <laughs> oh my god, Prince of Tennis. I still haven't actually, I think I watched maybe like two episodes. Its popularity was slightly before like when I was getting into things, so... So I didn't really watch too much of it, but I heard it's really good. I played organized tennis in high school. Oh, okay. So I see you do have some background in tennis. Oh my goodness. Cricket? Wait, isn't Cricket the one where, like, there's, like, a hammer and a ball? And then you're supposed to hit it into, like, certain goals or something? Is that Cricket? If that is Cricket, I think Cricket has been be be blah blah blah, become more popular recently, I think. Oh, I've seen pickleball gain traction. It looks fun. Yeah, I think it got popular like a few years ago. And that's also when I got into it. And I was, yo, I'm not gonna lie. I was kind of a menace. Oh, crud, it's croquet. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Ignore me. <laughs> okay, croquet. Croquet? Croquet? Cro croquet? I I'm confusing it with the... The, like... The potato croquet. Are they pronounced the same? If they're pronounced the same, then that's good for me. Uh, <laughs> can this place the dragon yaoi paddles. Wait, I need to make sure of this. Cricket. Sport. Oh my god. Oh my god, literally. They're just holding like a giant paddle like this. Like it's like the size of a baseball paddle, it looks like. Oh my god. Okay, this is not what I thought every time somebody brought up cricket. Okay, oops. Well, good thing I understood what it is now before it was too late. Oh yeah, so pickleball. Yo, I used to be kind of a pickleball menace. Until I wasn't. <laughs> but that, that game was so fun. I don't know what made pickleball so different from like tennis and badminton for me. Hmm. If the sweater is too thick, it's gonna seem more like winter or autumn. But maybe not. Wait, the other definition? Bruh, no, no. <laughs> like fruity? Like fruity? I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. Badminton also seems like a spring thing? Yeah. I guess maybe because they usually wear like, like t-shirts and shorts and stuff. Maybe that's why. Sounds more like golf. Yeah, oh my gosh, this was when you guys were were telling me what cricket versus croquet was. There's so much activities I never heard of. Oh, yeah, maybe some... Wow, there must be a lot of activities in like other countries and places that, that I haven't heard of. So much. Not... Oh, it's not pronounced the same. Uh-oh. Croquet? Croquet, croquet versus, croquet versus cricket. Oh, what? Wait, so the sport, like the hammer and the ball sport is pronounced cricket as well? Oh my god. Wait, I might be confusing myself. <laughs> 
Huh? The yaoi paddles are prevalent in Germany? What does that mean? Huh? Coke always makes me think of Heather's. The musical? I don't remember if I watched the entirety of it. I don't remember. But I used to have like a small musical era on YouTube where I would just watch all of like the animatics. Like I watched all of Hamilton just through like the animated songs or something. <laughs> and it was so good. <laughs> I mean, I guess I'm cute as a fruit, but that's the other definition, no. <laughs> Peachy. Peachy is a nice word. That's the, that's nice to hear. What will the hair color be? Oh, that's a good question. I mean, the sky is always generally the same color, right? Blue? Um... Oh, but I guess you weren't here, Ahmed, when I was updating my... Like what my future model will look like. The blue is gonna be a little bit lighter. Like it's gonna be more of a turquoise light teal. Oh, I can just show you actually. Like it's gonna be more of this instead of like instead of this. But I still, you know, nothing is super duper finalized yet. <laughs> Okay. Let me see. I don't know. I don't know if I associate long skirts with spring or autumn more. Here. I do like long skirt. Hmm. <laughs> the Hamilton animatics phase. Yeah, they are so good. Like, yo, like, I'm pretty sure. I cried. I I would bet that you probably cried too watching some of them. They were they were like really ooh ooh different fabrics for different seasons. That's oh, yeah, you're right. Okay, so long dress in both, but thicker fabric in cold weather. That makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Oh wow, conveying fabric is like a whole different thing than. Oh, oh, I think lots of frills for spring would be good. Yes, yes, yes. Mm. It makes me want to do a poofy sleep, but I don't really want to do a poofy sleep. Sheer, silky, flowy for spring is nice. Wool and heavy cotton works for fall. <gasps> oh, that... Okay. So today I wore a skirt outside. And when I got home, Mama Chi was like, Why are you wearing that skirt? That's like a fall skirt. And I was like, what? But it's a skirt. But it must have been because it was like a thicker fabric. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. Dear Theodosia made me cry. Crud, I'm... You know, maybe it's... Actually, no. I was gonna say I need to revisit them to remember because it's been a long time. But I feel like the moment I click on one animatic, it's over for me. I'm gonna go down the hole and I'm gonna rewatch the entire musical through the animatics. And then I'm going to move on to a whole different musical and, and, and my sleep schedule is gonna be over. <laughs> we make the hair color orange in the summer? <gasps> oh, that's a good question. When I was designing this, right, when I was designing myself, question mark, <laughs> I was like, oh, wouldn't it be nice if during different seasons, 
or not seasons during different like times of huh during what english if my hair could reflect different times of day like setting when the sun is setting right so then there's more orange and pink in the sky so i thought that would be cool but also i i haven't tested it at all like i haven't tried out what it would look like if my hair was pink and orange and purple <laughs> actually i guess there's already a bit of purple but yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna test with that actually yeah i oh my gosh farley you're so smart yeah i was also we're on the same wavelength i was also thinking oh if it rains maybe if i can be a little extra <laughs> and do a little research i can do some raining animation <laughs> yeah oh my gosh it'd be cool if i could figure it out mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> okay spring i'm looking at some images oh my god I don't know anymore. I'm gonna move these color. Yeah. Oh my gosh. If my hair was orange and red and pink i feel like that mood would feel so different compared to blue <laughs> figure switching the color should be easy do a mask layer yeah i guess color switching would be simpler what does skudo mean i don't know did i say that word i don't know <laughs> schedule oh maybe yeah <laughs> Set each mask to a hotkey comp. Oh my gosh, hotkeys. <laughs> I'll have to figure it out. Okay. I mean, this could be like long sleeves. Okay. <laughs> I'll move you two over here. Oh, actually, I don't know if I'm gonna go with this this headband with the bow in it it's kind of cute though dang wait how would it look like with an updo let me see copy paste thank you copy paste oh gosh I believe in you. Thank you. Changed my sleep schedule. Oh, is that a good thing or a bad thing? I mean, based on what you said in like some older Terraria streams, it seems like it's morning for you there. And 10 a.m. or 9 a.m. is not bad. Like, you know, it's good that you're waking up in the morning. <laughs> So are you having a better sleep schedule question mark i hope you are good oh nice ah <gasps> that's so good okay i've been having the opposite issue where my sleep schedule has been a little questionable but maybe it's time to reset my sleep schedule and make it good <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's nice to hear when people are like doing a nice change. That's always exciting to hear about. It was 5 a.m. Wait, um, I don't know how to feel about waking up at 5 a.m. <laughs> I mean, I mean, if you're getting enough sleep, that's pretty 
crazy, right? Like, I feel like a lot of bakers, like people working in food particularly, I mean, obviously other ones, other, other types of jobs too, but baking is what comes to my mind first. I think like people working in food have to wake up that early, which is kind of crazy to me. Oh my goodness. Awesome people. It's refreshing. Oh, okay. That is good then. Happy for you. Make our sleep schedule great again. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> I used to sleep, guys. Can you believe it? I used to sleep at 10 p.m. Oh my gosh, it's already 10 p.m. <laughs> that was years ago. Oh shoot. If I if I do an updo, how I can't really... Oh no, I can show it on the side like this. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm gonna stay up till 12 again. <laughs> no, Plangris. You need all the sleep you can get. There's always the VOD. Yeah, but at least it's a Friday, so hopefully you don't have anything huge. Oh my gosh, that reminds me, guys, I'm I'm visiting the glasses store tomorrow. Recently, I've been having an issue where... Wow, maybe I should draw glasses on my model, but that's kind of complicated. Like, I, I never draw glasses ever. Like, I'm struggling right now. <laughs> what the heck? How do you draw glasses? Okay. Um... Okay. Actually, let me draw from this view. Okay, this, like, you guys can tell what this is, right? Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, we're gonna leave it like this. <laughs> it's refreshing, I went to bed at 7.30. Whoa, wait, let me count. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Wait, that's a lot of sleep. You got like 9 plus hours of sleep. That's kind of crazy. Two hours sleep? Uh oh. Uh oh. No. <laughs> Winning glasses gang? I've, I've always been glasses gang. <laughs> I'm like you where we have glasses but we we don't have it on our model thing. <laughs> but yeah, I've had glasses for a long time. <laughs> but recently my pair of glasses, so this leg has been becoming loose so every once in a while like let's say i'm tucking my hair back right behind my ear so every time i do that since this leg is oops since this leg is loose it would become like this oop like it would open this much when normally it's not supposed to go past here right but it, it goes like it goes like here, and then it starts slipping off my face every time I touch it just a little bit. So I need to get that fixed. To be fair, so is Tabby. <laughs> Yo, oh my god, glasses. Okay, I was gonna say glasses look so good, but... But low-key, they're a pain. Especially if getting glasses is expensive. <laughs> but they look, they look so good. Glasses, characters, mm, yes. I was tired. Oh, that's why you went to bed so early. Well, well, I'm glad you can get such a nice, nice sleep. <laughs> Always has been. You can fix it using screwdriver. Wait, what? Hold on, let me look at my glasses right now. Um, oh, there is like a little screw. Oh yeah, there is something. Okay, but I guess, I'm guessing I don't have the tool, like, because it's, like, really tiny, the screw. So, I'll just visit anyways. And also because I've, I started thinking about contact lenses. Wow, I, I was literally just saying how much I liked glasses, and now I'm talking about contact lenses. <laughs> okay, but the reason why I want contact lenses 
is because I want I want to be able to wear sunglasses. But how do you draw sunglasses? This is like this is difficult. Why does it look so creepy? But yeah, I don't know. That's kind of a bad reason. But yeah, <laughs> I want to wear sunglasses when it gets sunny and stuff. Frog lens? Gaming lens? Is that a certain type? Prescription pair of sunglasses. Oh, that's a good... Hmm. Yeah, there's alternatives. Like I was thinking about it, but I think in the end... I still want to try contacts. Like, at least I'll ask my doctor, like, wait, my optometrist? Is that the word? Like, is it possible for me to wear contacts? And if not, then it is what it is. But I kind of want to try it. And then I'll be able to be like, okay, contacts are a no-go for me. <laughs> or maybe I'll like having them. Mm -hmm. When I was younger and like I would go on a trip or something, when I was younger and I had glasses, I would put the sunglasses right on top of my regular glasses so I would be wearing two glasses at once. And it was so bad. <laughs> but that's what I would do when I was younger. So I want to be able to experience wearing sunglasses and only one layer of glasses <laughs> I have a website use my glasses frames are a lot cheaper on oh website it's pretty good it's also been a while since i visited my optometrist so i might as well okay oh hmm i don't know I have to think about the length of hair. <laughs> I guess I should put this. Huh? Okay. We got short. Medium and long. Uh, this is a bit tricky. I mean, it's also different outfits. Okay, let me think of a third one. Oh man, I'm still not over this one. I like the look of the ribbon on the under the chin so much with the hat. So I guess it would be like this. I don't know. I like that look a lot. Well, I don't remember ever seeing this in person. <gasps> That's a question. Do you guys tend to wear hats ever? Like a cap or like a beanie? Well, actually, that's Migu, right? Migu's the beanie. <laughs> or any hair accessories at all? Fedora? <laughs> <laughs> bucket hat what else is there there's like oh I have a cap that looks like this I really like this one I forgot the name for it I mean it looks like a paper paper boy hat I, I don't know. I might be completely wrong. <laughs> but I have a hat like this and it's really nice. I wear hats. Caps. Caps? Yeah, caps. <laughs> hats just feel uncomfortable though. Hmm. I like hats. But I do... I will say that taking off a hat is not the best feeling. Because then the hair, you know, it's all messed up all messed up and then you have to pat it down <sighs> but i like wearing hats maybe maybe if they're uncomfortable it's a sizing issue 
or a material issue. Because there are some like stiff hats that are just not good. I do fisherman beanies and baseball caps. What? Wait, baseball caps? You go to baseball games, Tuna? I know baseball caps are just the name of the type of cap. But I'm curious because... Wait, I'm not mistaking this, right? You're the one. Yeah, you, you're you you're sending those hot dogs. And I always assume it's at like a baseball game. Okay, let me search it up. Um, fisherman beanies. Oh! Wait, is this like the type of beanie Migu wears too? Okay, okay. So this is like a, like a short beanie. So it's like, it's like this. Ooh. Okay. Wow, I didn't know that's what it was called. So I guess regular beanies are the type that's like... And they're like, kind of bigger. Oh, I also have a bucket hat for ultra sunny days. Oh my gosh. Yeah, bucket hats are kind of nice. I feel like there was at there was like a point where the people around me or like I was just on some part of the internet that was like bucket hats are so weird. They look so bad. And then like a few years later, people were like, "Oh, bucket hats are so cool. They're so nice." I don't know. People's opinions keep changing, but I guess it's just it's just good to wear what you like. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm I think bucket hats are nice. Now there are three of them. Are you talking about hats? <laughs> oh, oh, them. Yeah, there's three now. And they all have different hair. I I don't know what to do about the hair accessory. Let me see. Remove this. I feel like having the bow might be a little too extra. Like, it'd be nice to... Mm, I like it, though. Like, I'm drawing a fan art right now, and I gave the characters, or one of the characters, this type of hat. <laughs> or not this type of hat, this, like, ribbon under the chin whole action. It's a Eurocamp fan art. Honestly, I'm struggling with it quite a bit because I'm trying to have, like, I'm trying to do some things that I usually don't do. Like certain types of poses or a background. So I'm kind of struggling. <laughs> but, but I hope I can share it soon. Or maybe I can just share a whip soon. Ooh, those hats are cute. Paperboy hats. Oh, these? Yeah, I know. They look so good. It's like my favorite hat that I own. But I don't wear it too often because I don't... I don't like wearing hats, like, to certain events. So... <laughs> I don't want to have to take it off and then the whole hair messed up thing happens. Yeah, but I really, really like this hat. It's like, um... Let me see. It's like a pink... It's not... it's like a dusty pink. Actually, that's not it. Maybe gray. Like, it's gray... And it has some pink... And purple... Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna... I don't... I can't from memory. <laughs> okay. Looks a little older on the right. Oh, maybe because of the hair. Oh, I guess these like curly bits make it make her look a little younger. And also these, these this part. Wear a baseball cap and never go to baseball games. I do go to baseball games every now and then. Oh my gosh. Do you ever do you get the food at baseball games like the hot dogs or what? What do they have at baseball games? I rarely go to sports ball games. They have popcorn. 
they have popcorn, right? Popcorn, sodas, hot dog, hamburger. <laughs> Wait, you eat breakfast right after waking up? <laughs> oh, was this because I asked you about breakfast or something earlier? Do I? Sometimes I don't have time to eat bleh, eat the breakfast. <gasps> oh, thank you for this question. It reminded me of something. Guys, do you when do you brush your teeth in the morning? Do you brush your teeth right after you wake up or after you finish eating your breakfast? This has been something I was super super curious about, but I forget about it. <laughs> I forget about asking it. I think you're supposed to put flowers instead of the cloud. Pink and purple. Flowers instead of the cloud? Where? I could put... I could do flowers. Like this. Whoa, drawing at an angle. to seeing it i have no idea what i said when you sent that <laughs> but thank you <laughs> jelly of folks who can wear hats my head's too big for hats <gasps> oh my gosh farley i have a hat i have a hat that i think would be so cute to wear but i think it's like like a teen hat so my head is too big for it <laughs> So I can understand you on a certain level. Oh my gosh. You know what would be cool? If if your partner... What should I call him now? Kobold? Grunkle? Has he ever made a hat before? That'd be kind of nice. That'd be an interesting project, making hats. But I don't know how well hats in leather hold up. I don't know. It's good. Don't want to attract the wrong audience. Older look is good. <laughs> I mean, I like, I like, uh... Oh, this one? <gasps> Wait, you know who this reminds me of? Wait, actually, I completely forgot right as I said that. Who does this remind me of? It's an anime character from... I think a horror anime. But I don't remember which one. I don't remember. Oh, your brushing teeth opinions. I can read them now. Definitely brush before breakfast. I don't eat breakfast, so I brush right when I wake up. I stay in bed for like 15 minutes, then I go brush them. Okay, yo, that staying in bed for like 15 minutes is so real. After, I don't like the toothpaste taste, and then you brush out the food. My headphones can count as a hat, right? Nope. <laughs> But your headphones can count as a as a hair or head decoration accessory. I don't know. Boyfriend has made leather hats. Ooh, cowboy kind of hat from TF2. Wait, what is TF2? That's a game. I've definitely heard it before. Team Fortress. Okay. Ah. Oh my gosh, cowboy kind of hat. You like what you're trying to say? I like cute characters, okay? I, I realized the moment I started talking, I was like, okay, crud. People can take this out of context. Um, but yeah. But I like this look as well. Hmm. Really like the outfit on the right, super cute. Oh, like the longer one? I'm actually gonna change... Um, I guess I'll change the middle one. I kind of like the long skirt on the long hair, so I'm gonna change this one. Actually, before I start erasing, I need to think. Okay, we have long... Mm. Oh, I completely forgot. Okay. <laughs> I asked you guys all for your brushing teeth stuff, and I didn't say my own. Okay, so what I do... I do what Plankus does. I brush my teeth, um... After I eat breakfast. But I do rinse my mouth before eating breakfast, like with some water, 
because like after right when you wake up there's like this weird like like weird taste in your mouth and I don't like that so I have to rinse my mouth a little bit before I eat breakfast oh huh, this is interesting stuff like when you eat breakfast after brushing teeth wouldn't you have to brush your teeth again because there's food in your mouth I don't eat breakfast, so brushing is first thing in the morning. Oh, so you're like similar to Farley type situation. <laughs> cowboy hats? Yeah, cowboy hats are cool. How does a cowboy hat look like in the front? Cowboy hat. I made it. Oops. I make it really tall. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, this would be kind of bad, because if you walk into a head... Headway? Doorway? If you walk into a doorway, this hat is just gonna fall off. Okay, we need a more normal length hat. I don't know, I think I'm drawing the bumps funky. Why does it look funky? Okay. Goodbye, hat. Hmm. Okay. Do you brush your teeth after lunch? Oh, shoot. Wait, you, you bring up a really good point. I don't, but I should. I only brush my teeth twice a day. <laughs> if I eat meat, the food will stay between my teeth. So, so you brush your teeth after? Wait, no, you brush your teeth before. What? It's not. You, they shouldn't stay between your teeth. Big hat, yeah. Big hats are nice. I like the big, like, witchy hats. Oh my god. Has come to my realization I've never drawn a witch hat before. Anywho. Hologram hat? Wait, what do you mean? Like it's a fake hat? Like it looks glitchy? Think of the top of a hat that's like a button or like a Pringle. Oh my gosh, like a Pringle. Oh. Okay, I drew it too big. Okay, well, I'll keep that in mind. Oh, yeah, I was drawing like this. Oh, wait, that's so good. Actually, let me try. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think it does look, yeah. Instead of like a butt. Oh my god. Oh, that's so good to know. Nice, okay. There was a Pringle. What was it called? Pringle. There's like a specific type of grid or object. There's like a math word for a Pringle shape. I forgot what it was called. <gasps> Let me see. Hyperbolic paraboloid? Is this what it is? <gasps> yes, it is! Okay, guys, this is the hyperbolic paraboloid. Can I put it on stream? <gasps> Whoa! Oh my god, it like just, it like phased th into existence. <laughs> yeah, so this is a hyperbolic paraboloid, guys. Doesn't it look like a Pringle? 
Kringle shaped. Oh, actually, my bad. So that's the hyperbolic paraboloid. Oh, oops. Uh, don't look at that. Oops. <laughs> Open image. Can I do this? What the heck? Um. Uh. That's not good. That's not good. Um. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Wait. Oops. Let me. Let me. Let me undo some things. Holy crud. Okay. Okay. Nope. We'll have this here. Okay. Will this work? Hello? Okay, we're back. Whew. Okay. So... <laughs> actually... Yeah, I think it is this. There's a paraboloid, so this is hyperbolic paraboloid, and there's also a regular paraboloid. But I don't really know what the difference is between the two. But it looks like a Pringle, right? Don't eat meat at breakfast, only in dinner. Oh, that makes sense now when you said the... Okay, that makes sense now. Ha! Huh? It's like a flattened plane and then it's crumpled parabola. Ah. Still calling it a Pringle, yeah. <laughs> I think when I learned about this in class, I put in the notes like Pringle shaped. My Pringles aren't that bendy? Really? I think this is pretty Pringle-like to me. It's been a while since I've had a Pringle. Do you guys- do you guys still- <gasps> Do you guys eat chips still these days? I've realized I haven't really eaten chips recently. But Pringles were really... Satisfying to eat? Question <laughs> mark. Do you guys have a favorite chip flavor? I think recently at home, I only have like these rice snacks. Like crispy rice snacks. I think if I had to say a favorite chip flavor, it's probably just sour cream and onion. <laughs> or barbecue. They're kind of basic, but they're tasty. Have you seen the ring of Pringles? Huh? Is that a math thing? I don't think I've heard of it before. Or is it a chip thing? We have become parabola. Oh my god. I don't know why that photo just took up the whole screen. <laughs> I eat chips. I like cheddar truffles. <gasps> Cheddar ruffles? I love cheddar! Oh my gosh, I can't believe cheese flavor escaped my brain. Yeah. Tortilla chips are all the rage. For you? <laughs> oh, I think I just had tortilla chips today. Wait, they might not have been tortilla chips. But I had like the, the triangular looking ones. And we had it with guacamole. It was really tasty. Like these chips were so good. They were so crispy. Yeah. But Mama Chi and Papa Chi were like, I don't know if it's a skill issue, but some of their chips like broke when they were trying to dip it in the guacamole. So I don't know if that's like the chip or if they're being too, too aggressive with the guac. <laughs> Only if others brought them all oh, the chips. <laughs> Onions? Onions. Wait, I haven't had a Funyun in a while. Is Funyuns... The onion ring chip? Is it? It's like Chester's hot fries. Those are my favorite. I have never heard of those. Let me search it up. Chester's hot fries. Whoa. Wait, I have seen these before. Wait, maybe not. Okay, I'm confusing it with Cheetos. Because they are both like... Wait, what animal is this? A jaguar? A leopard? Interesting. Is snacks cheap? They should be cheap. If they're expensive, then it feels a little bit like, you know, snacks? You're supposed to enjoy snacking on them. But if the snack is expensive, every time I eat it, I'm gonna feel like I'm eating my money or something. Corn chips better than potato chips. 
that is an opinion. That is an opinion. But I don't think I really notice when I'm eating corn chips. Hmm. So I don't know. I'm gonna have to see. I'll get some corn chips and try them out. Snacks used to be cheap. <laughs> Cries. Snacks used to be cheap. You used to be able to get a big bag for a dollar. I don't know what it is like anymore. Sour cream and onion. Yes, yeah, hype! Sour cream and onion! So good. Plain? What? What? Do you mean plain? Like the original, quote unquote, original flavor of chip? Honestly, I guess plain is okay, but it's just okay. Like there's so many other flavors out there. Oh, it's the same brand. Interesting. Oh, I love Pirate's Booty Chips. Why does that sound so weird to say? <laughs> it's... Wait, I'm thinking about the right one. It's like the puffy, like, kind of... Like this. Is that what Pirate's Booty is? I like the white cheddar one. Those are, those are so good. I haven't had them in a long time. It's like 3.40 for a snack bag. Ugh. Well, maybe higher prices can have us make different decisions. <laughs> okay, what if I do like a poofy short sleeve? This. What other snacks are there? Oh, gummies. I haven't had gummies in a while. That is not a poofy. <sighs> reference, reference. Popcorners. I like popcorners. Are popcorners a corn chip? Wait. Don't answer that question. Don't answer that question. Don't answer that question. I did not just ask that. Oh my god. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Popcorn. <laughs> kind of just no kernel. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think I am thinking about the same thing then. Like a puffy chip. Recently, really been enjoying apple chips and freeze-dried- <gasps> Freeze-dried berries? Oh, I don't think I've ever tried snacking on those. Is it various berries? Like blueberry, strawberry, raspberry. I don't really like raspberries. They look so cute. And like, raspberry flavor is pretty good, but the raspberry fruit itself, I can't eat it for some reason. Like, I cannot ignore the seeds, the berry. So like, the same thing goes for blackberries. But apple chips are really good. I think I actually have some apple crisps at home. Is chips considered a snack? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Popcorners make me think of Breaking Bad? How? I've never watched Breaking Bad. I think I would like Break. What? I think I would like watching Breaking Bad. Is that the zombie one? Wait, no. Don't listen to me. Um, I'm thinking about The Walking Dead. <laughs> okay, Breaking Bad is okay. Breaking Bad is Walter White, Walter White, and the other guy, and Jesse. Okay. Okay, I see. Oh, they had a collaboration. I see. All strawberry. They're good to add to yogurt. I've had like a love-hate relationship with yogurt. They would be so good with fruit. Oh my gosh. What I like, I like eating, um, what's it called? Skir? I think I'm butchering the pronunciation. But it's like a really thick Icelandic yogurt and it's so good. It's so good. I love skir. Breaking Bad Popcorners. 
<laughs> I need to see this commercial after. Where to watch? I don't know. <laughs> I like rarely watch rarely watch American live action. Oh, except Severance. Do you guys know what Severance is? Severance. That one was pretty good. I think I binged that one, which was a terrible idea. And I was feeling really empty for a while. It's funny because my high school AP chem teacher was oh, also named Mr. White? Huh? That is not a coincidence, Tuna. <laughs> I love Skier. I know, it's so good. I like, there's something so good about it. There's a Greek yogurt brand I really like. Something I'm curious about is Greek yogurt, like the yogurt that's just by itself. And it kind of has like an... I don't love Greek yogurt because I think it kind of tastes like nothing or like not nothing. It's like a certain sourness to it, but I might be eating it wrong. Mm -hmm. We used to have, um, what's it called? Faye? Faye? <laughs> and Mama Chi would like eating it, but I couldn't, I couldn't eat it too often. Coffee? Wait, I don't remember. Have I had coffee skier? That sounds so good. Must investigate. Yeah, oh my gosh, I need to look into it. Okay, maybe I'll go for a more poopy one this time. Ooh, or I could go for... Hmm. Dang. Greek yogurt is thicker and a bit more neutral. Oh, that's the word for it. Neutral. Tasting than American yogurt. I really like the strawberry and raspberry one. <gasps> Yeah, I do remember when they came with like a little side cup of like fruits or something, then it would taste, it would taste pretty good. But like I couldn't, purpor not proportion, I couldn't ration it correctly. So I would always end up with like Greek yogurt left over and then there's no more like fruit sauce to eat it with. <laughs> so then I would be like, no. I will never have Greek yogurt again. <laughs> or at least I never have like the Greek yogurt that's by itself. I like adding oh, condensed milk to Greek yogurt. I've never thought about that before. Makes it taste better, but also like it's more sugar. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, but condensed milk is so good. But we rarely get condensed milk anymore because when we used to get condensed milk, um, it would come in like a pack of like two or four cans, but we wouldn't really use enough. And then we like stopped getting them because we didn't use them too much. We also have a great mango one they have, which makes the yogurt taste like mango lassi. <gasps> I, I might be butchering that pronunciation. I've always wanted to try that because it seems like, like, like a thick, sweet, drink oh my god it looks so delicious from the pictures yeah i want to try it one day mango la how to pronounce Lassi? i don't know but it looks so good <laughs> need these ones it's the fr fruit puree blended into the yogurt so it's like a perfect <gasps> oh okay so those you don't have to worry about not being able to ration the sauce all right the sauce the fruit and the yogurt okay, that's nice
maybe I'll get back into yogurt for spring. Yogurt does feel like a very spring and summer food. about this one. Hmm. Nah. I'm not loving it. Actually, it's not so bad. <laughs> but it's a lot of layers. care i hope you have a good sleep <laughs> thanks for dropping by feels healthy yeah yogurt feels healthy plus greek yogurt has a higher protein count for serving than other yogurt oh wow protein protein makes me think of working out but instead of working out i've been dancing instead what were we talking about again yeah, snacks and yogurt. Bipe? <laughs> oh my god, bi hype equals bipe. Oh no. Okay, okay. Mm, let me think. Or I could go for something that's poofy. Here and poofy. I'll see. Water time. Oh my gosh, when do you guys whenever I say water time or when somebody else says water time, like on stream I guess, do you guys drink water along with <laughs> Do you guys even have water on your table or or next to you right now? Huh? Huh? Are you staying hydrated? Huh? Because you should be. <clears throat> I drink too much water. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Okay. No? I drink a lot of water. Okay, that's good. Sometimes <laughs> for my coffee, tea. Yeah, those are good too. Nope, but I have about eight. I'm gonna assume you meant half, half full bottles. No! No, I used to be like that when I was like in my gremlin, like not like <laughs> gremlin mode, bringing in a new like cup of water and like a bottle of water or something. And oh my gosh. No, no, no. That's another good thing though about like drinking from like a cup or a mug or a glass instead of bottles. Then you won't have like eight bottles lying around on your desk. <laughs> You'll just have your mug and then when it's empty you get more water or or soda, I guess. Actually no, no soda. Recent playing is recently I've had like I had some soda and like it was so crazy. Like I don't I think I'm not a soda person. Like it was so so intense soda. Goodness. Okay. Damn, I'm kind of... I'm split between... Let's do A. Okay, we have some labeling. I'm split between the outfit for A and C. Hmm. I am a fan of the long skirt. Uh, the hair... I mean the hair, I'm... I don't know. 
I'm okay with any of the hair, I think. I think it's also kind of not easy to compare because they also have all, all different hair accessories. Like, I don't know if I want to go with the beret. What happens if I draw a bow here? Hmm, nah. A little too much space. You can have the bow under the chin for special occasions. You're not used to the power? Yeah. I've been soda list for so long, it's too strong for me now. Favorite soda? Dr. Pepper. Or Sprite. Oh, you know what I've wanted to try? I've wanted to try the Baja Blast. You guys know? I think it's Mountain Dew. Baja Blast. Isn't the name so funny? <laughs> It seems like a refreshing drink, but when I drink it, I will probably just think it tastes like any other soda. <laughs> I'm a big C fan. You got some drip too, though. Yeah, this hat, yo. I also like, I kind of like the layering that's going on. Like, it's not going to look exactly like this, but I don't know. A looks mega lolly, bruh. I think that's only because, like, she's got the short hair and, like, a very round, like, thing going on. Let me see what happens if I make the skirt longer. Yeah, it's probably the hair. <laughs> the hair. Yeah, I- oh, actually, I wasn't drawing it, like, to look like pigtails, but I do think the pigtails would look cute. Like, I was drawing it like this. Oh! Somehow never tried ba blah 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 Baja Blast? Yeah, I don't know. I've never- I've just never seen it around, I guess. Let's go Dr. Pepper, right? It tastes so good. Well, I remember it tasting so good. I haven't had it in a while. It's probably too powerful for me now. I think my favorite soda ever is... Manzanita Soul? Mexican apple- Oh, apple soda sounds so good! Wow, I have to look into it. Caritos Mandarina. Is that an orange one? Orange soda? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Going off about sodas. We compensate with different body proportions. Oh my god, Nisando. This is this is not finalized. It's just for outfits, yeah. Or hair. Or of hair. Oh yeah. Like a big head. Make your hair longer or more mature in another way? Oh, neck. Ah, uh -huh. banana flavored soda? There's banana flavored milk. Which is pretty tasty, but I think it's just a lot of sugar. So I don't know if it would, if it's really that tasty. I think that's good yeah i think that's good actually that smaller head neck a little longer thing mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah i'm kind of digging a now crud 
What if I give you... Eh, I kind of like the bow. I don't know. Back, <laughs> welcome back, I'm in. Do you quickly color the outfit for A and B? I don't understand too well. Yeah, I haven't really thought about colors yet. Maybe I should do that. Let me do that. Yeah, big brain. Okay. Whew. Cried. Coloring. My greatest enemy. Maybe. B's head is still kind of big. Maybe that's okay. Nah, let me... Okay. Huh? Selection empty? Oh. Just gonna leave it like this for now. Captain Hat. <laughs> Stick to grayscale to help differentiate. You're into full coloring right away. That's a good. Uh, you know, I'm just gonna scribble, scribble, scribble right now. But I have been interested in like the grayscale coloring method. I think her head is a little not centered, but it is. It is what it is. I've been interested in grayscale coloring first, but I have to wrap my brain around it. <laughs> oh, maybe I could do like white stockings. manga i oh it's been a while actually i would say i watch more anime than i read manga mm -hmm. what was the last manga i've read let me see Boop. and it looks like oh Okay, the last manga I read was called Firefly Wedding. Oh my gosh, unintentional Hota reference. But yeah, it's like a it's like a romance drama fighting. There's like a yandere guy in it. <laughs> it's kind of angsty. <laughs> Sounds cute. <laughs> It did sound cute, but it, it was it's a little it's a little intense. <clears throat> but I really liked it. It had some oomph. It had some oomph to it. Yeah. It's about this um this lady who is like from a rich family, but she's like really sick. And one day She's like being escorted into the like village <laughs> by her bodyguard or something. And then like she gets kidnapped and things happen and then she ends up asking this like super like kind of crazy but really strong guy. And then it's like sort of just their relationship building up. But Loki this guy's still kind of crazy so I don't really know but I think he's like softening up sometimes. Who's marrying Hota? Oh my god. <laughs> She's not the Firefly though. Here. The name was Firefly Wedding. I guess it's more... Yeah, I guess it's just mostly drama and romance. Okay, back to this. 
Eh? Why is there... Eh? Uh-oh. My, why is there a random line? When did it... Okay, there we go. Eh? Do you see this line? When did I... Huh? Okay. Oh my god. Huh. <sighs> Yeah, line on the wrong layer, but good thing it was like not so bad. Not too many steps behind. Yeah. Oh yeah, but Ahmed, you're asking. Are you asking because you've been reading some manga you liked? <laughs> oh reading yeah, my hand probably just brushed on the screen. Did you watch Parasite? Um, are you talking about the the one with Migi? Like this thing? I cannot draw from memory. It's like an alien thing. <laughs> oh no, I can't draw from memory. I don't know what it looks like. <laughs> Let me search it up. Migi Parasite. Oh, whoa, never mind. It has like another eyeball thing. Wow, it has a really realistic mouth. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, goodbye, Miggy. <laughs> Miggy. <laughs> I really like Miggy, actually. Actually, you know, uh, yeah, the hand, yeah. Oh yeah, I <laughs> I didn't know what to call it, so I just put the first word that popped up into my head. Okay, hair. Um. Oh yeah, but if that is the parasite you're talking about, then I've watched it. I don't think I finished watching it though for some reason. I should finish it. It was pretty good. Lookism? Oh, okay. Well, that's... That's manga. Yeah, not manga. I used to... I used to watch Lookism. Not watch. Read? Read Lookism? And it was pretty good. But then... I... I did... <laughs> I stopped following it. And then there were so many... They call it episodes, but it's... It's just chapters. There were so many chapters. And then I just never caught up. I liked it when I was reading it. Oh, you know what? Ma or did I say ma webtoon. Webtoon is the word for it, I guess. I remember reading one. It was called Sweet Home. Sweet. It was like a why is it so thin? My pen. Sweet home. It's like a horror. Drama, action, webtoon. Where like there was some disease that was spreading and it would make them turn into monsters. Make people turn into monsters. But it got like pretty psychological and it was like really sweet and heartwarming and I liked the ending of it. It was into lookism until like episode 200 something. Yeah, I don't remember. It's been so long. Difference between manhwa and manga. Um, I think it's... Korean versus Japanese? Maybe? That's my understanding. Sweet Home sounds interesting. Shall I investigate? Yeah. There's also a live action of Sweet Home. Um, that's how I found out about it first. But um, the live action, when I was like watching it, there was only. It wasn't complete. So then I just read the webtoon and it was. It was good. Mm hmm. It's good. Okay. Hmm. If I do pigtails, I'm gonna have to change this. <laughs> it's looking a little funky right now. But let's just do outfit. Hmm. If I make the stockings white, then I can't make the dress white, which is what my original intention was. 
Well, I guess in the pilot version, my dress shirt is white, so maybe it's better to change it into a different color. Maybe green. Mm, let's see. I don't know. Green and... No. Mm, no. Green and blue kind of not it. Hello? Or maybe I chose the wrong green. Mm. Wow. Okay, next thing to study is color... Color. <laughs> I'm not loving this. Blue... Meh... Colors hard. Yeah, why? Why does it have to be like this? Maybe purple? Purple's not super, super spring. Oh my god. <laughs> I kind of look like a chick. Which is kind of cute, but I don't know. I like the yellow. It's very cute. Yeah, it is a cute, like, it is a cute color. Banana color. Oh my god. Yo, if this is the color of your bananas, I think you need to get a different banana. Because this is pale. Okay, yellow. Did the shoes match? Mm, pink. Oh yeah, I was just remembering. So you remember I made a post about those like, what should I paint on these pots? <laughs> so... Oh my god, you guys gave me such good ideas, but I only ended up having enough time to like paint two. <laughs> and I was so sad. <laughs> because there's so many good good ideas you guys gave me. But I think um I took like I took a meteor yeah, mediocre photo of them. So when I remember to, I will post them somewhere. Mm-hmm. Those flower pots will be going into the homes of some foster kids. So I hope they like them. <laughs> yeah, no bochi, unfortunately. I think what I did was like some waves and a cloud. <laughs> it's kind of basic, but, but I think they turned out okay. Actually, the waves one was kind of meh because I hadn't used acrylics in like 10,000 years. But, but it was okay. It was fun. Hope they like it. Okay, what am I doing now? Mm. Pink. I don't know how to feel about this. White? Meh. Why is color deciding so difficult? I can do... I can do this. <laughs> it just it looks like a piece of candy is on my head. I don't know. I'll figure something out. But pink is such a spring color. Hmm. Mm, no, no. I'm digging the yellow better. What if it were a little bird? Oh! Oh, <gasps> do you mean the headband thing? 
Oh my gosh, what if a bird was just on my head? <laughs> oh my gosh, it would be cute if I knew how to draw a freaking bird. <laughs> Mint? Oh! Oh! Wait, is this mint? Ooh! That's not bad. Hmm... Maybe, maybe, maybe. And I could put the pink down here, I guess. Maybe? I don't know. Sometimes I'm worried about putting too much color that it doesn't look cohesive and then I'm worried about not putting enough color where it feels really bland. But I guess it's something I'll learn to figure out. Okie dokes. <laughs> I was focusing on this one. B, B and C neglected. Makeup with the color, make a pattern in the dress. Oh yeah, pattern! That's a good thing, good idea. Like, checkered. Oh my gosh, wait, but pattern... Oh my gosh, drawing pattern clothes is... Okay, I'm getting lazy. Oh, but I see, like, adding some texture. Oh, and white. Goodbye. Floral. Oh my gosh. Floral. Floral is good for spring. Hmm. <laughs> I need to practice this. <laughs> it's over for me. Oh my gosh, floral is even more unga bonga, <laughs> my brain. think about it which one I'll do which one I'll end up doing yeah I did like the squares I like the floral kind of too oh my god this is hard why is this so hard but still kind of fun I kind of like it I kind of like this I can help figure out how later. yeah that would be nice too. Okay, my gosh, no. My feet, they're falling asleep. Okay. Hmm. Huh. Water. This means it's stretching time. <sighs> okay. Ah, uh, spring. I hope the weather is nice. 
Huh. Hmm. Real bros make Pinterest boards of cute clothes patterns for each other. Oh my god. That's the best. Hmm. Oh. Okay. Oh, I'll leave A like this for now. I don't even know if I want to color the other two. It's freaking me out. Oh, actually, maybe this is a okay time. Oh, crud. If I do orange or pink in the future, that's so different. Okay, let's not do that right now. Oh my gosh. Okay. Need to think. I should probably do a different color palette for this one. Maybe. Okay. I ran out of water. This is not good. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'll stay. I'll stay hydrated still. Hmm. Have you guys been playing certain games recently? I know I've only been talking about like Terraria <laughs> because for the past like seven streams, but I've started to miss playing other games as well. <laughs> Terraria just rain some water. <laughs> You're not supposed to drink rain though, right? Like there's stuff in rain that I think we're not supposed to drink. No, no games playing this <laughs> tour. Ender Lilies! I've... I've been interested in that game. Because, um... Millie made some songs for it. I love Millie so much. Due to storage. Oh, okay. I understand playing this. But that means you can have more sleep. Less game, more sleep. More happy, more healthy. Try out that sticker game that Tad recommended. Oh yeah, I remember that one. Doing Stardew, Sims 3, and Terraria. Oh my gosh, you've been all over the place, Farley. <laughs> oh, interesting, interesting. Yeah. I'm thinking of the next game to play. Sometimes I think back on <laughs> after breath of the wild i was playing kirby but i don't know if i want to bring kirby back oh lethal company i heard that lethal company had like a pretty big question mark update recently with like some new enemies or something oh my gosh lethal company was so fun but i haven't played it in a super long time I see a theme in front of these games. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Hmm. Wow, Lethal Company. For Lethal Company, I used to always just be the ship person. Actually, I might have said this before. Oh my gosh, but if there's new monsters, I'm gonna know even less about the game. Like very relaxing games, farming stuff, slice of life, and then lethal company. <laughs> Bam, just like that. Those games are nice. <laughs> yeah, it's interesting to like think about people's games that they play, right? Like a lot of people like playing FPS games. Cozy games are not unpopular. 
And then there's like, what else is there? Puzzle type games? Question mark. And then the ones where you like have to build your kingdom or something. <laughs> My brain can be pretty mean and I grew up with not best friend. I mean, comfy times is something I cherish. Yeah, comfy is so good. Comfy, relax. I want to try lethal company out, but horror doesn't mix well with <laughs> me. Yeah, yeah. That is something I've been seeing. Hype has also said he doesn't do so so well with horror. I think I'm okay with it. Like, I'm gonna get spooked, but I can deal with it at least. And it's... Sometimes it helps to like, I don't know, laugh at scary things. <laughs> that can make it better. Can't do games like COD, I get way too stressed out. Oh my god, wait, Call of Duty. That counts as a shooting game, right? Yeah, those... Uh, spooky. Yeah. Lethal Company, I think... I mean, you could be the shit person playing this. You don't encounter too, too many monster, like, jump scares that way. But recently, I think I need to... I need to become stronger. I need to go inside the mansion and get the loot and reach the quota. I think being the ship person is fun. I also like things like Pit Cross and puzzle games. My boyfriend, that's like mind blow every time I get a perfect on Pit Cross. Is Pit Cross the one where there's like, there's like a grid? And then there's like numbers on the side. And then it tells you like how many blocks you have to fill in or something. Yeah, okay, okay. Whoa, I used to be... <laughs> I used to play it, but I would play it when I was not supposed to play it. So then I stopped playing. <laughs> oh my gosh, that seems fun. Perfect on Pacross. I didn't even know you could do that. Can't do team comp games. Last time my teammates in power and yell at me. Oh no! Oh my gosh, same. I think I, I stopped playing like, um, some of those games because like my teammate would be like, "What are you doing? I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to learn how to play the game. What do you mean? Ah, gosh, I'm gonna forget about my team and just scroll on Twitter. Oh my god, not during the game. At least you have to, 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 to. Think a little bit about your teammates. I don't know if I want to do stockings here, actually. Eh, I don't know. How am I feeling about the brown? Meh. Socks. I love socks so much. I don't know why. Okay. I guess you can be a darker brown. I love horror games. I hate playing them. <gasps> I- wait, that's so true. That's so true. I used to love watching like... Horror game playthroughs or like summary of horror movies. But like, I wouldn't be able to watch the horror movie. And like, playing the horror game is something I still have to get used to. I'm worried it feels a bit autumn with the brown, but I kinda- I don't- I kinda like it, actually. <laughs> I just put this hat here for fun, but it's just here now. Haha. 
do 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 do. I like the brown clothes. Nice tones, really. Oh, it is. It's a. It's a different mood, but it's, it has its own charm. Yellow shirt, paste. I guess you like. You like yellow. Brown is nice. Oh, wow. Thirty per. Wait, really? Thirty percent of your wardrobe is brown. I feel like brown is one of my least. Um, percentages. It's kind of western <laughs> because of the hat, maybe. Cowboy. <laughs> oh crud! It's it's moving away from spring. No, no, no. Let's move on to C. Okay. Something here. Selection empty. But there's something there. Huh? This is freaking me out, guys. Oh, I found it! Do you guys see this? Are you serious? What is this? What is this? Hello? Okay, goodbye. <sighs> Majority of my outfits are very colorful, but it's all stuff in the 90s. Eh, that's not a bad thing, right? I feel like... I feel like 90s clothes can look pretty good. Colorful is interesting. Actually, I don't know <laughs> how much of my wardrobe is what color. The vest? Oh, this thing? Yeah, it's kind of cute. Oops. Hmm. What is everyone's favorite color to wear? I feel like people's favorite colors um differ from the color that they wear for some reason. Or maybe it depends on the person and which color. Maybe, maybe. Don't get the top piece. Uh, wait, what? Oh, this? It's like a white-ish. I specifically seek them out. Oh, a couple years ago, I did a complete wardrobe changeover. Oh, that sounds nice, though. Like that means at that time you like know what you want. And then hopefully your wardrobe is a little more something that you like. Color is color. <laughs> Don't have a favorite color. I like deep purple and olive green. Oh my gosh. Yeah, those are... Oh my god. Even <laughs> on YouTube, the, it's showing up as a purple. I don't know if that's just a coincidence or not. Hello, Tony. Purple is your favorite color. <laughs> what the heck? Is it just a coincidence that your profile picture is purple? Oh my goodness. Olive green is nice. Crud. But both of those are not spring colors. Wait, do you tend to wear purple and olive green though? Hmm. My favorite color to wear is yellow because it's such a happy color. Also my favorite color. Okay, so you fall into the category of favorite color is you tend to wear yellow. Wait, is that a sentence? Favorite color and you tend to wear that color. Or you like wearing that color. I like wearing brown and then black. Oh, so it's good that 90% of your wardrobe is is brown then. Yeah, I like neutrals. Really like coral, warmer pinks and teals. Oh, well, those are good. Whoa, pink and teal. Wait, coral color. What would a coral color be? You know what? I'm not even going to try. <laughs> but in my brain, it looks really pretty. Oh my gosh, wait. Oops. Oh my gosh, I look like a salmon. <laughs> Those are nice colors. Brown clothes gives off super cozy vibe. That is true. I wonder why. I guess because it's a neutral. 
but but whites and blacks and grays are also neutrals but they don't feel cozy they feel cold strange colors so strange but so cool What is my favorite color? What do you guys think my favorite color is? Have I ever said what my favorite color is on stream? Maybe I have. <laughs> Maybe this is a trick question. Do I have a favorite color? Probably. I think my favorite color changed throughout the years though. Hmm. Let's see. Green was probably my favorite color for the longest time. It probably is still my favorite color. <laughs> yeah, green. But lately I've been really into blues. So I'm not so sure anymore. But the thing is, I don't wear much green at all. <laughs> I don't wear too much blue either. What the heck? Hmm. But I do have a few green clothes. And blue clothes. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I had to pick a specific green, maybe this? Eh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, yeah, it's, a, it's a nice green. It's a nice green. It starts getting confusing when I'm in teal. Wait, I was gonna ask, is this green or blue? But it's just teal. What am I saying? <laughs> Janice, hello! Oh my gosh, this is your first... This is your first... Me not playing Terraria. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Oh my gosh, wait. We need to bring the question up again. We're gonna bring the question up to everybody, guys. Janice, do you brush your teeth in the morning? Before or after you eat breakfast? I mean, if you just use neutral grays and blacks, it makes sense. Your favorite color wouldn't be in rotation. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Christ. Actually, no. But if you wear neutral grays and blacks and whites and stuff, you can pretty easily put in like a random color in there. I don't know. No time these days to think about what I'm wearing. Okay. What color scheme do I want to make you? I'm feeling pink for this one. Damn, no green? Oh, we could do pink and green. Wait, man. Honestly, I'm not in love with the sketch itself. Like, I have no idea what's going on. Mm, this green and blue is a little meh. Brush my teeth after breakfast so that they stay clean all the way up until lunch. Yeah, same here. Hmm, so it looks like, let's think. The people who brush their teeth right after, like after waking up, either they don't eat breakfast or... Hmm. I need to revisit the trend. I had gray and huh? I guess gray and black go with everything. Yeah, I think so. Thinking blue, but light blue would be summer and dark blue would be winter. <laughs> black dress. Sheesh. 
black dress and the spray. <laughs> I mean, you can wear whatever. But I'm trying to give off the springiest spring vibes. Actually, I guess B is not super spring spring, but but it kind of kind of hits. I don't know. Are you doing a separate layer and color shift it? Um, I know what you mean, but I'm low key already in too deep. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. GG. <laughs> Next time I will. Hmm. I don't really know what is going on here. Like, what did I do over here? There's like, there's like three layers over here. This is kind of weird. If I were to go out to eat breakfast, I would brush my teeth first, but I don't usually. If I were to go out to eat breakfast... Oh my gosh, going out to eat breakfast? You'd have to... I don't remember the last time I've gone out to eat breakfast. Hmm... Nurse get up. Really? Oh crud, wait, you're kind of right. It's like a nurse hat. <laughs> Cries. It wasn't supposed to be like this. <laughs> Let me get rid of this, maybe. Will this help? I'm not feeling the outfit for C, guys. I think I messed up somewhere. Maybe this. Maybe I can put a vest here. these normally brush my teeth at night yeah actually yeah i can see if you brush your like people brush their teeth before sleeping so when they wake up they don't wait okay now i'm getting confused that's cool no complaints your nurses got drift it's true <laughs> breakfast is the best meal to eat out you guys go out to eat breakfast? I think I went out to eat breakfast once, but it was like when I was visiting a... When I was visiting a friend. But in my usual daily life, I would never consider going outside to eat breakfast. It sounds nice. It feels like you'd have to wake up super early for it. Okay. Got the best action going on. Eh. We have another one. Migu. Do you brush your teeth before or after breakfast? I eat one meal a day and it isn't breakfast. But if you only eat one meal a day, isn't that always breakfast because you're breaking your fast? <laughs> nice. Isn't that strange? You can say morning as a greeting, but you can't say night as a greeting. Did you brush your teeth? <laughs> oh my god. Kinda looks like a nightcap. Yeah. Because it's long. 
I like nightgowns. Nightgowns, I think more, I think nightgowns, more people should wear nightgowns. Nightgowns are nice. They're so comfy. I feel like a lot of them would look really nice with cute pose. Yeah, they're all just kind of just there right now. <laughs> Morning. <laughs> 6 a.m. Goodness. I love 6 a.m. Oh my gosh. I'm snoozing at 6 a.m. <laughs> yeah, it's so good to have you. <laughs> I brush after breakfast. Okay, so you're after breakfast brush club. Otherwise, the food breaks down the floor. I eh. Food breaks down the floor. I eh. Oh, oh. You make tents more expensive to get a better vibe for the aesthetic. Do you mean expressive? Expensive? I wish I was expensive. Wait, that doesn't make sense. <laughs> I'll probably fall asleep again. Yeah, I mean it's a it's a Saturday over there, right? A Saturday morning. I would you could not catch me awake, six a.m. on a Saturday morning. Wait, actually, that sounds like really impressive though. Six a.m. on a Saturday morning, you could do so much. You have the entire Saturday. I don't know. <laughs> um, I am not gonna... I don't know. I'm just trying to get a feel of the outfit. How to make more expressive. Maybe I can give her a bow. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, no, no, no. Fluoride can be broken down? I thought it was just an ion. Wait, what? No. We're going back into chemistry? Wait, is this chemistry? I don't know. Okay. I think the lesson is I need to take good care of my teeth can't catch me awake at 8 a.m. any day of the week. Oh my gosh. Ascendo, you're gonna have trouble if you plan to work a 9 to 5 then. <laughs> Unless you get lucky and like, you can live really close to wherever you're working. I wanna sleep, but I really wanna watch. Hey! Plangus, enough said at I wanna sleep. I think, I think you know what you want. Or I guess you can just watch until you fall asleep. People do that, right? Like, I used to do that. I could watch, I could watch like the funniest video ever. I'm gonna bring up Cub Scouts again because I laugh every time I watch his videos. But like, <laughs> I could be like, hee hee ha ha watching a video and I would still knock out. I would still conk out because I'm tired or something, even though it's so funny. Same reason why you're not meant to drink water after brushing- Oh crud. It just flushes all your work away. Well, I don't drink water after brushing my teeth because it feels like I'm gonna eat, eat the toothpaste. Wait, so you shouldn't rinse your mouth with water after brushing your teeth? Question mark. Give like a smile or smirk or something. She- She's smiling. She's she's smiling. I I don't know. <laughs> A winky face? Dude, I don't think I can even wink in real life. Eh? 
I don't know. Outfit's cute as heck. Miku, thank you. Means a lot. <laughs> I have to decide on one. Or a combination. Or something totally different. Flower petal? Wait, where? Oh, you mean in her hair? I don't know. Perhaps. Arm up for peace sign. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I'm just really lazy right now. <laughs> I don't want to think about how it would look. Oh my gosh, wait. Peace sign looks so cute. Oh my gosh. You can do a 9 to 5 if it's 9 p.m. to 5 p.m. <laughs> That's true. If you don't want to wake up at 8 a.m. <laughs> don't forget to floss. Yeah. Thank you. I needed that reminder. I mean, no, I didn't need that reminder because I'm so perfect at taking care of my teeth. I always remember to floss. I don't disappoint my dentist. Yeah. <laughs> My new apartment is like 20 minute walk to my future work. Oh wow, that's pretty lucky. Peace sign winky face? Why does that look so funny? <laughs> Peace sign winky face. Hold on. Oh my god. <laughs> Fortnite dances. <laughs> Cry. It's watching Coast Scouts yesterday. Yeah. Um, oh my gosh, yeah, I think he released a new- he releases a new video, like, almost every day. And I send mods in this game of Coffin and Andy and Lele. Oh, wait, yesterday? Oh, you were watching older videos. Okay, yeah, yeah. You call that a smile shout out. <laughs> Delicious toothpaste. Guys, mint choco ice cream, yay or nay? Have I said this before? Tell me if I've asked this before on stream. My brain is kind of like exploding. Not literally. <laughs> Choco mint ice cream. Yay or nay? Yes, it's better to not rinse after brushing your teeth so the paste stays on your teeth and continues doing its thing. What? Oh, okay. So what I should do after I brush my teeth is I shouldn't rinse my mouth with water. I should let it sit for a bit. Maybe watch a YouTube thing or two. Catch up on some VODs. Do some math. And then... And then rinse my mouth? We do, we do rinse the mouth with water at some point, right? Because the toothpaste won't disappear. Short hair tension is my favorite. <laughs> Happy you have one you like. Yeah, A is cute. The yellow is very spring. Cannot rinse toothpaste, but I hate mouthwash. <laughs> mouthwash is so spicy. Like... But I think it is good for you, I think. You just noticed your hair. <laughs> Not that big fan of mint choco. Yeah, it's it's like a split thing. Yeah, look at look at these split 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 opinions. Oh my goodness, <laughs> mint choco chip is my favorite. Yeah, ice cream. I mean, but I guess there is mint chocolate chip flavor of other stuff, but but only ice cream comes to mind right now. I'd eat mint chocolate chip. Because it is ice cream. <laughs> but it's my least- eh? It's your least favorite? Toothpaste flavor I oh! Toothpaste flavor ice cream just seems weird to- It's not toothpaste flavor. If it was toothpaste flavor- Toothpaste flavor, I'd want to eat toothpaste. But I don't want to eat toothpaste. What is your favorite ice cream then? Other than tuna, because tuna says mint choco is your favorite. <laughs> I think my favorite is probably pistachio and lemon. I love the burn of brown mouthwash. Wait, what? Isn't mouthwash green? That's just whiskey. 
A was my least favorite before, but after head adjustment's very nice, bro. <laughs> well, I'm happy to hear that. Best flavor in your opinion? You mean mint chocolate chip? Oh, I'd eat toothpaste if it was safe, bro. Hmm. I don't know. When I brush my teeth, I'll think about it. Would I eat this right now? Actually, that's a dangerous thought. I don't think I think I don't think I should think that. Would I eat this right now? As I'm brushing my teeth? I think I'd accidentally eat it. McDonald's shamrock shake. So good, Minty. I've never seen that. Shamrock shake. Is that only available during like Um Oh my god, wait. My brain. What is it called? What is the green holiday? Um <laughs> What was it called? <laughs> no. Um like the Yeah, yeah. St. Patrick's Day. Oh my god. Is it only available during like around St. Patrick's Day? I prefer pistachio or cold stone coffee mixed with their sweet cream ice cream. Whoa. Oh, coffee ice cream is pretty good. I've rarely had it before, but oh. Is Cold Stone a brand? I've heard it, like it sounds familiar, but I don't really know what it is. You have definitely asked this one on stream before, favorite ice cream. I think the last time I've asked about favorite ice cream was like when I was not myself, if that makes sense. <laughs> Because I do remember asking this on stream before, and I do remember saying pistachio and lemons. <laughs> Chocolate chip cookie dough? Texture's the best? Oh, okay. Texture. That is true. Chocolate chip cookie dough. But you're not supposed to eat real cookie dough, right? I think. <laughs> Wait, if you mouthwash with whiskey, would it be clean? Ah! <laughs> this is a dangerous question to ask. Wait, why? Oh, wait, what is in mouthwash? What makes mouthwash good for your teeth? Does whiskey have that? Can't go wrong with vanilla. That's true. A, real, a good vanilla is really good. Which I have not had in a while. Gold? Wait, what's gold? Gold ice cream? The green holiday. Okay, but you know what I meant. Green day. <laughs> was that a- That was a band, right? Green day? <laughs> it is indeed the green holiday. Was it that long ago? Do you remember mine? Um, your favorite ice cream? Well, I'm gonna assume it's lemon. Because of the color yellow. <laughs> or or chocolate chip that's my other guess wait not chocolate chip cookies and cream i don't know why i said chocolate chip you can just depends on your eggs wait what did i ask <laughs> salmonella Wait, why are we talking about eggs and salmon? Oh, cookie dough! Oh my god, I completely forgot. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, this is a dangerous thought to entertain. I will not eat my cookie dough. <laughs> Mouthwash breaks down tar tar. Wait a minute. Isn't tar tar and tar tar? Are they the same sound? Like, you know, beef tatar? Is that spelled and pronounced the same? The tartar in our mouth and tartar? Beef tartar? Some mouthwash have alcohol, most also have fluoride. Oh! 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 So that's what Migu meant. The food will break down the fluoride, but we need the fluoride. We okay. So why people in Japan tend to be okay with Oh yeah, my gosh, like the raw egg eating in Japan is like whoa. They make it look so tasty. 
but I don't think I can eat it because of texture issues. Gold ice cream. Wait, really? Was Plangus talking about gold ice cream? Oh my god, Codename Kids Next Door! I don't remember the gold ice cream at all. What the heck? Dang, you didn't remember Pink Whip. Wait, what was- Oh, oh, okay. Okay, so it was the cookies and cream. It doesn't protect your teeth though since it has less fluoride content. I'm assuming you're talking about whiskey. <laughs> okay, I got it in the end. It's all good. Okay. There is a point to this stream, and the point is spring. <laughs> so, I was referring to Patrick's Day. Wait, what? Gold. Oh, green and gold? I see. I see. I'm talking about mouthwash. Oh, crud. Oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't know anymore. <laughs> okay. So spring. Okay. Oh, this was Migu. Now that you're here, I'm. Mm, I'm gonna just quickly explain this again because I already explained it earlier. But do you remember when you made like a bald penty comment on Twitter? I was. I thought about it, and this was from like all of that. All of that. <laughs> so if I'm bald, it's not good for us. Because if I'm bald, it means. It means Earth is doomed. Basically. Oh, Tatar is... Okay, it is spelled different. Tartar is the buildup. And cream of Tartar is a powder that's harvested off of wine barrels. What? Did you just make baking powder? What? Oh my goodness. There's so much. Why did they all name it Tartar? I mean, it, it's fun to say, Tartar. <laughs> but yeah. Okie dokes. Um, yeah, so it just hit me, like, if I decide on an outfit or some design, it's gonna stick with me for spring. <laughs> so for the next, like, two, two-ish months, two, three months. Mmm... Fun packs of barley. Alliteration! So good. Okay. Uh oh. Someone's revving up. Someone's revving up. Broom! Can you guys hear that? I don't know. Okay. Off they go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Also, your boyfriend came up with the alliteration. That's so good. Okay. So I am kind of leaning into a. Personally, but I do like what B has going on, and I like the long hair C has. But I guess I already have long hair, so I guess to switch it up a little, I can go with the shorter hairs. Mm -hmm. Professor Farf, <laughs> that's so funny. A A, okay. Oh my gosh, wait, A A. It was meant to be. Okay. Shaving is fun. Yeah, I like this roundness. And then a bit of this, that. I know, right? I like this hat and vest thing going on too. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's crazy. Oh, of C. Oh, you like this. Oh, you like this round hat. Oh. Yeah, I know. It looks nice. It looks nice, but I think it's because, like, I'm, like, question mark here. So I think if I worked on this a little more, I might lean into C, but... Cries. Why is it AA, by the way? Top 10 mysteries of the Earth. I, I don't know. <laughs> it's either more lore to think about, or... Or it'll just- oh my god, not the Alcoholic Anonymous Air <laughs> Airport. Oh my god, Amber Alert. Run. 
Oh my god, Janice and Red had the same brain. The freaking batteries, man. It can be whatever you want it to be. Okay. So, it's looking like A... <laughs> is both... Is that crying a good cry? I think it's cute. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I think I'll work on A. Bing, bing, bing. And then, yeah, I'll see if like, while working on it, I want to incorporate other bits and stuff. See how I... Oh, like a nice round hat. Yeah, maybe. Cuteness tears, oh my god. Lemon tart and tea. Yo, I love... I make a mean lemon tart. Okay, I say that, but I only made it once. Oh wait, no, I didn't. I made it like two times or three times. Wow, that was a long time ago. I think it's been a year since I've made a lemon tart. Let's see a winky face piece I pose. Okay, I'll, I'll do that. Not now. <laughs> you wanna see me in chat? Wow. What is this? <laughs> Slip, I'm tired. Yeah, good night, playing goose. I think... I mean, I am wrapping up as well. Oh my gosh, nice! We did some cute, cute things today. Baja Blast. <laughs> I like talking about food. And she loved Ah... I will either try to find it and then repost it on Twitter. I'll see. Or I can just completely make a new lemon tart. <laughs> cooking stream? Oh my gosh, we need a cooking stream with Farley. <laughs> I do want to cook. Or bake, rather. I feel like I don't really know how to cook. It's more baking. They look like fruit flavors, banana, coconut. Oh my god, wait, you're kind of right. Strawberry. Oh my gosh, yeah, if I do red instead of pink. Hopefully that looks like frills and not blood. Uh, red shoes. Oh, I think this helps, actually. <laughs> yeah, the net. World's biggest supporter, it's so true. <laughs> Share the net. <laughs> Please. I want to try making lemon tart, they look so tasty, yeah. I have to be careful with how many lemons you add, because I kind of went crazy with the lemon because I guess it was a bigger than normal lemon and it was so sour but the friend I was making it for liked sour things so it turned out fine <laughs> and the rest of their family also liked sour things so that was even better banana coconut strawberry oh my gosh <laughs> that's so cute Mayor's lemons are good for tarts because they're more mild. Oh! Specific lemons! I'm learning so much. <laughs> Sour yummy. No, I can't agree with Migu on this one. I don't like green apples. I like the sweet ones. Mmm, green apple. <laughs> okay. We have an agreer. This type my boyfriend likes working with for alcohol. <gasps> what? Mayor's lemon straw? 
Oh my goodness, so fancy. You hate red apples? That's... what? Huh? But, but... But they're so tasty! Oh my goodness. Bougie tasty, yeah, for real. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, where did the pink go from here? I don't know if I'll stick. Oh. Wrong layer. Oh! <gasps> this is on the wrong layer! Uh oh. Okay, well, I mean, it doesn't matter too much right now. Okay, anywho. I think A is the winner. But I'm attached to B and C. But A will be the winner for now. Oop. Sweet apples for pie, sour for eating, just as they are. Hmm, you have a point. <laughs> Do you prefer green apples? Haven't had one in a while. What? Oh my god, this is so shocking. I haven't had a green apple in maybe like many, many years. Huh. Okay, well, maybe next time I see green apple, I'll get it. And then I'll let you guys know. <laughs> Where's the. Huh? Baja Blast! Okay. Sour pie good? Mm. Oh, well I guess that's lemon to sour pie. He had black clothes that might give me 2010 Tumblr vibes. Oh my gosh. That's an eraser. Oh my god, it's gonna be too edgy. I'm gonna leave it at coconut for now. <laughs> Busy night. Interesting. Well, we are wrapping up now. Oh my gosh. Okay. I need to wrap up for real, for real. So, closing notes. Hmm. Triple teaming. Oh my god. Oh my god. Farley. <laughs> that is busy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well. We'll lighten the load for now, because we are wrapping up. So, I guess what will I do? I'll work on A. My original plan was basically to draw the new outfit on, on the sitting person over here. <laughs> but I don't know, maybe I'll have a new pose if I'm feeling not lazy. <laughs> so I'll work on that. And then tomorrow, I'm going to prepare for a Terraria stream. <laughs> There's a lot. There's a lot in Terraria right now. There's the dungeon. I think that's the biggest thing, probably, the dungeon. There's probably other stuff, but I don't remember. <laughs> I'm barely functioning right now. I know, right? Like, sleeping sounds so good right now. Do not have the mental capacity for more than one stream. <laughs> That's so real. Yeah, Farley's crazy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, tomorrow, yeah! Hopefully, yeah, I've, I plan to finish it. Like, draw the spring outfit for tomorrow. Hopefully, I get it done. Oh, right, and the freaking glasses appointment tomorrow. Okay, well... I mean, during the Terraria stream, you guys will hear about how my glasses appointment turns out. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, the the jungle. Okay. Woo 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 woo. Much to look forward to. No, my vision's not getting worse. I I've had glasses forever, and my vision still. Well, it's it's bad, but it hasn't been getting worse. I'm just checking. I'm fixing my glasses because. This one is loose. <laughs> Let's pretend she lives in the north. You can postpone the fifth hour. Wait, the, all, all the north, like... Okay, yeah. I thought you meant north hemisphere. <laughs> we had minus two degrees. What? That's... 
That's not the type of weather that spring should have. Oh my goodness. I hope it gets warmer over there. Lots of suspension. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Clap, clap. You can't see me clapping, but clap, clap. Much to do. And now it's time to rest. Yeah. Or like gamer or or watch something or <laughs> or eat something for the rest of you. Your house on the left? Yeah, I don't know what I'll do with these. Maybe spontaneous arts. Because I do like them. Smelting stream? Oh my god, that'd be so crazy. Hopefully the timing matches up tomorrow. Oh my goodness. Yeah! Mega Eep inbound. So true. Okay, yeah, thanks everybody. Woo! For, for helping out and giving me your thoughts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watching. Don't forget to brush your teeth, crud. Yo, you caught me. I was about to fall into my nice bed. That would have been bad. Okay. Yes, yes. Don't forget to brush your teeth. Thank you, thank you. I'm, I'm gonna peace out for now. <laughs> bye, bye. Hopefully, see you tomorrow. Take care. Thank you.